what's up what's up it's your girl crb and i am back with another video so i was just gonna uh, let me get it together so i was just gonna go ahead and just start the video but then i was like let me just make an intro because it just seems much more organized to me <laughs> but yes i'm back with another video um so pretty much i'm just going to be taking y'all with me throughout my day um well days because um it's a vloggy vlog <laughs> um but yeah so like just stay tuned just watch you know do what you do only three dollars bomb bomb all right so i got some eggs that's not for the board but i just wanted to pick up some breakfast items bacon okay so i got some spinach this oh no something is wasting oh. so i got strawberries and this is probably what's wasting yep i probably smushed one who knows? I don't know. But so I got strawberries. <laughs> the spinach is for my breakfast stuff. Um I got this, the mozzarella balls. It says it's in marinade. I never tried this, but we will today. I got some gouda cheese. Love that for us. I got some creamy pepper jack. I was looking for like some spreadable cheese. So I got this because we love pepper jack in this house. I got some extra sharp white cheddar because I love that for me. Um, we got us some blackberry spread. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so all these also have like this already, which is some pepper salami hot. Mm, I'm gonna let y'all figure that out. Mm hmm. So got that. I also got some prosciutto, of course. And then I got some grapes as well. Cause you know, we gotta have this a little bit of everything on our board. We got some pepperoni. And then I got this honey goat cheese because girl, bomb. If you haven't tried it, get some. And then I got some honey cause I'm gonna put that on there as well. So everything came out to be $52.04. And like I said, that's everything for the board and then a couple of breakfast items, including the wine. Uh, oh, I forgot to show y'all these. I got these too. And I figured this would be a more bang for my buck instead of getting um, all the different ones by themselves. So hopefully they're good. We'll see. But yeah, so this is everything that I bought, guys.
update my resume. But before I do so, I want to make me some breakfast. So we are going to go ahead and get that started. So let me set you guys up. grass today period so i'm going to make a little breakfast um y'all i haven't been home in so long like so so long um i left the top out <laughs> on some cheese oh my god but yeah so i want to make me a little breakfast hopefully <laughs> Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully everything has not expired because once again, like I said, I have not been home. So stuff may be just a little old, but we're going to see. I think it's a little couple of eggs in there. We'll see. Um, those eggs look like they're out outdated, <laughs> but we'll see. Spinach eggs. Do I want bacon or sausage? Or do I want Koneka? Let me put y'all on. Let me put y'all on. Let me tell y'all about this. So Koneka is made in Alabama, of course. You know, your girl is from Alabama. <laughs> But it's a, a county, Connecticut County, is where it's originated from. They have different kinds. This is, I think this is probably the original. Well, no, I think they have original. This is the hickory smoke. Um, they have spicy, Cajun. They have all flavors, and all of them are good. Let me just throw that out there. So, um, I think I'm gonna actually do that instead of bacon or regular sausage. So let's go ahead and get started on that. So I guess I can do maybe like a little scramble. Um, yeah, we can make us like a little scramble. We can do that. to find the skillets bro oh it's in the sink <laughs> don't judge us we haven't washed a dish we actually just used this last night and did not wash a dish okay so now that that is clean we go ahead and put that on the stove and turn that on let me see if we have some onions i would love some onions in my um, in my stuff. And you guys, so we still had like some stuff left. Let me tell y'all how well, for one, lazy, and two, just doing stuff. Like, we decided that we were going to go hang out. Hey, we don't have no onions. Or no peppers. Let me look over here. Well, farmer, or whatever we'll make do. Um, so yeah, we decided that we were gonna go to one of Morgan's friends, my friend Morgan, uh, one of her friends' house to, it was a card party or something like that. Yeah, so uh, we decided that we were gonna go to the card party and like, baby girl, we just threw on some clothes and ran out the door. So that's why everything is like still out. <laughs> we have not a clue what we're doing here. Um, yeah, so this. Give me a soundtrack. I 
hate to be that person that just like open packages any kind of way, but it was giving me a hard time. So it is what it is. So we're just gonna take this and cop, chop it up in some little pieces. And this is a lot um, for my scramble, but I really love this sausage. So it is what it is. When y'all cook sausage, do you put oil in your pan? I don't because normally sausage or bacon or whatever meat you're cooking with normally comes off um, like a little oil when it starts to cook down. So I don't oil my pans, but do y'all?
So, let me go ahead and do a little taste test for y'all. That Kanaka sausage. Take your meal from a Sam to a 10. I'm telling you. It's going to do it every time. So, now I'm just about to eat. Um, I brought my little setup in my room. Just because I do have a lot that I need to do right now. Like I said need to update my resume so i'm basically updating my resume because um delta is about to open up their um flight attendant positions and yes i already worked for delta but i work for a regional carrier of delta so hopefully fingers crossed y'all say a prayer for me that i get this job delta mainline <laughs> But yeah, I'm updating my resume um, so that I can submit the application. They open up the applications tomorrow. So I'm updating my resume so that I can submit that first thing tomorrow. Um, I also need to do my hair. I may film, may not, because I, it's a, the bob week. I've done a video on that before. I um, also need to straighten up some more in here. Like I tell y'all all the time, my room is very small, so... Any little thing that's in the floor makes me feel like I'm cluttered. So I need to clean that up. Um, also, I have started back journaling. Y'all, so much has been going on in my life. Um, within the past month or so. So I have started back journaling. Um, shout out to Andy because this came in one of her boxes with her candles. And I have been using this. So... Um, definitely need to get it together um, because I've been very inconsistent with journaling and journaling is like my outlet um, I'm able to like really express how I feel about things and excuse the lighting like I said I'm in my room I forgot to turn the light on I'm just being lazy and didn't get up and turn the light on I do have my window open right here so that's what's bringing in a little light um, so yeah definitely got to get back into the routine of journaling like i said it's really like my only outlet um outside of like my sister and my cousin because those are like my besties <laughs> um so definitely got to get back into journaling um so basically um a lot just has been going on with my roommate which is morgan uh, one of my friends um ever since i started working like i <laughs> I'm going to upload that video for y'all because I forgot. Maybe it's going to be uploaded by the time I upload this video. But ever since I started my job, I haven't like really been at home. Even when I'm off, like I go to Birmingham to be with my family. Um, and it's like we have kind of drifted apart a little bit. So we, we're kind of trying to rekindle that friendship. Um, as you can see, that's the reason I did the board last night and we kind of hung out in the living room um, and then we went out to the car party. But, um, so yeah, that's been going on. Um, on August 8th, my life changed forever. Um, I got the news that my brother was shot and killed. So, and I was at work while all of this was going on. So that changed my life forever um i probably would never be the same but i'm just asking god to heal my heart um later in that week that saturday um the 14th my sister uh got married my brother was supposed to walk me down the aisle on that so that was a lot um but before the wedding i got news that my one of my favorite aunts passed away um, COVID was a triggering factor to that. She had other health issues though, um, but she did get COVID and that kind of just took her out. Um, not to say it that way, but that, that just was the icing on the cake. Um, so that was heartbreaking. Um, lost a, another extended family member to COVID. Um, lost a family friend, a long time family friend to COVID. Like COVID is real, y'all. Take care of yourselves. Do your vitamins. If you can, get the vaccine shot, y'all. I'm I I know that a lot of people are against it. 
um, for whatever reasons, but you have been vaccinated since you were newborns. It's nothing new. I mean, now, yes, we are aware of more or whatever, but you guys, y'all have been vaccinated since newborns. Let's not make this into a conspiracy thing. Like, just get vaccinated. If you don't, do all that you can to avoid getting COVID. Like, this shit is real. It's been real, but once it hits your close family, it's, it's really real. Um, and I've had COVID, so I know the struggles of it. But yeah, so, so much has been going on in my life. Um, so much death has been going on in my life. So this is my outlet right now. Um, I, eventually, I probably will go to counseling to kind of help me get through this. Um, and I'm starting to get emotional, so I'm going to stop it here. And so I will finish eating my food. Um, and I'm watching Tasha, uh, Natasha Smith watching her YouTubes. Um, I pretty much ever since I've been home, cause I haven't been home. Like I said, when I was fixing my food, I haven't been home in like two and a half, maybe three weeks. Um, so yeah, I'm just right now I'm just catching up on all of my favorite YouTubers. Um, I kind of just get my life together. So I'm going to finish eating and then I will be back. Um, once I'm done. This is like the fastest way indoors, or you can put it up on your ceiling fan, but I did not want to do that. So here we are, and um, I'm gonna put it on in a second, but I just wanted to show y'all how ghetto it's looking over here. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> All right, y'all, so I'm still in the process of doing my hair. But instead of doing it my normal way and just having just like a regular bob, I decided that I'm going to try to get it as close. Let's see if we can focus. There we go. As close as possible to this. So, we shall see. We shall see. Um, pretty much did all that I wanted to do to this hair for today. Um, I didn't do, I mean, I, I did as much as I was going to do to it. Like, I probably not going to be able to achieve the look that I was going for all the way, like 100%, but I got pretty close to it. Um, so now I'm just like laying my edges. Um, but yeah, I probably end up having this on for the rest of the night. Um, like I just said, I'm not doing anything else to this hair. I'm about to, it's what, five, six o'clock? Let me see. 530. So, um, yeah, and I don't plan on going anywhere. So, that's pretty much just going to be me, what it is for tonight. Because, again, where am I going to be doing my hair all the way? I mean, it'll be nice to go ahead and complete it, but... Um, it's gonna get messed up when I go to sleep tonight anyway, so I'd rather just not do anything to it. Um, as far as in, like flat ironing it, I did do a little bit, but I'm not doing anything else to it. It is what it is. So now I am just, um, I done brought the charcuterie, charcuterie. I don't know what how to pronounce it. I need to look it up and stop pronouncing this wrong. Let's see.
Okay. Charcuterie. Okay. Period. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. So I pretty much just ran across the question on Google. It was like, why are um, charcuterie boards popular now? Because I'm just like, you have, um, they've been out for forever. Um, but it's like, nowadays, they're just so popular. And cha, when I'm feeling bougie, I get these at the restaurants all the time. Let's see her pronounce it. Charcuterie. One more time for y'all. charcuterie so yeah i said it right but anywho um so yeah i done brought that back out for dinner tonight um because this is the vibes i've been feeling and i don't need to be eating all this meat and cheese because i done gained so much weight dealing with everything that's going on right now um you know once somebody passed like people just be bringing all types of foods and stuff to y'all house so I'm trying to gain so much weight, so I don't need to be eating stuff, but here I am. Here I am. It's going to be okay. I love these little um pepper jack, the spreadable things that I showed y'all yesterday. Let me see if I can pick it up. The little pepper jack things. I love these. They spicy. They like more spicy than just regular pepper, pepper jack cheese. I don't know if it's because it's spreadable or whatever. I don't know. Wait, so bomb. So, I'm over here. I'm about to watch Poor Minds. It was like my favorite, well, one of my favorite podcasts. And I really love it now. I need something to say now. But I really love it now. more than ever because um they're backed up by the 85 south show like they um producers and stuff so i really be watching it now like this is my jam so Yeah, y'all. So this is poor Miles. That's Drea to the right. Polo's in the middle, and then that's Lexi. Love their show. It's just been lit. So y'all go tune in. I'm about to finish this board and watching this, and I'm checking out. No, but, um, so, as y'all can see, vibing out, I got my bonnet on, just got out the shower, um, did my little skincare routine, gown on, um, I'm not about to go to bed, but I am about to just, like, vibe out and write in my journal, it is 9.07, I'm trying to see if y'all can see that, um, p.m., so I'm definitely not about to go to sleep. I'm just about to um sit here, write a couple of thoughts down, and um turn my music back on. I'd rather be smoking weed whenever we breathe. Every time you kiss me, don't say that you miss me. Just come get me.
to me. And because I work tomorrow, but it's only a day trip. So I definitely need to make sure I got my wallet. And let's see. Wallet. Oh my. Birth control pills because we gotta have it. And let me turn my light on in here. That's how you know I'm ready to go to bed. <laughs> but so this is my little bag when I do like I mean I take it with me on all my trips, but if I have like a day trip, then I only just bring this bag. Um and that's it. Because it has everything that I pretty much need. Um, so I'm just gonna add the items that I just showed you guys. My shoes, well, my heels are in here. My flats, of course, I wear that to the airport and then like change my shoes once I get like once I pull up to the airport, then I change my shoes. <laughs> I put my heels on a little bit. That's what I'll be doing until I find some comfortable heels because I just, I haven't found any comfortable shoes yet, but I know it's because I barely be looking for any. So I'm like, I can just keep switching. Like, let's, let's see. I have my retainers in. <laughs> so that's why I'm talking like that a little bit. Um, let me see my luggage. I don't think I need anything out of here. So like I said, it's just a day trip. I'm going to move back home tomorrow night. So yeah, I don't need anything out of that. But I just wanted to come back. Um, Alright y'all. So it is a few days later. <laughs> <laughs> a few days later. Um, the last time I vlogged was probably the 29th or 30th or something like that. I don't know. Um, today it is September 2nd. So it's a new month, new goals, new motivation, new, new everything. So um, I just got home from work. I went on like a little two-day trip. Um... So I just got home and um, I did my makeup before I came to work this morning. Like, look at your girl. Hand clap for her. <laughs> um, so I did my makeup before leaving for work this morning because I was like, when I go home, I need to make sure that like I get my content together. I do some TikToks, you know. Um, you know, I just had to make sure I get back into the grand scheme of things because like I said I have been slacking for the month of August so much has been going on in my life so um yeah I just I just had to get it together I really did so um I gotta y'all I seem it seemed like every day I'm straightening up this damn room like I'm so tired of it but um I just do not like Colado so I'm about to straighten up, wash clothes. Um, anytime when I come home from a trip from work, um, I immediately come out of my clothes. Um, of course, you know, I go wash my hands, you know, that type of thing, because COVID is still out here. Um, so I try to make sure I take care of that part. Um, and then I come and I like go through my suitcase. So everything that I've worn, um, that's dirty and stuff like that. Like, I just make sure I put it in my dirty clothes so I can wash clothes because that's, like, one of the third or fourth things I do when I come home is I go ahead and wash clothes so that I won't be trying to do all of this before my next trip. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so, that's what I'm about to do. I have already poured a glass of wine, some Chardonnay. Again, um... I, I came home and got straight to it as far as in like doing my videos and shit. So um, that's why I poured a glass of wine. So we did. I wish I could show y'all the TikToks, but um, <laughs> I be trying not to. Um, I mean, not trying not to. I have not 
I did it on my phone. Y'all know I do not have a camera. I'm, I'm going to get a camera eventually, y'all. I promise. But, you know, I do not have a camera. So, I was doing um, TikToks on my phone. Let me see. I think I posted one. Yeah. Well, I actually posted two to my Instagram story. Why is that playing? Is it? Child, my phone was on silent. It had like it just did not want to play. But I don't know who this is. Let's call him. I got a phone recording. But yeah, so here go one. When you actually have time to wear your products. Yeah, I have been wilding on this dog on the Instagram. I mean, TikTok, but I have to get into it because. I'm like the old people. I cannot keep up with all this stuff. So I've been trying with TikTok. Um, let me log back out of this because it's my work phone. No, ma'am. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I'm trying to get into the groove of things when it comes to TikTok because yeah, and it's still I still haven't learned all the transitions and all that. It's just a lot. It is a lot. Um, but I'm gonna I'm gonna get to it. I'm going to get to it. I'm going to learn what, what Yvette said to Jody. I'm going to cook. I'm going to clean. <laughs> so, I'm going I'm to learn all this stuff. I am. But it's just so much. And um, it's not a lot like to learn. It's just time consuming. Like, you have to really sit there and replay the video several times. Hear the music several times. Goddamn. Um... Child, I, I, it's just a lot. It's a lot. But I'm trying. I'm trying. So, yeah. Been doing that. Um, but, yeah. That's pretty much it, guys. Um, I do hope that you enjoyed these couple of days with me. <laughs> um, but, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and, and get to doing what I'm doing. I need to get these. Y'all, I keep looking at my hair. I don't know if y'all know this, but I keep looking at my hair because I don't really don't like baby hairs. Um, so I keep looking at my hair, which it don't look bad, but it's like, girl, I'm just cute as shit. That's all it is. <laughs> but no, uh, so hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. And make sure if you are new to this channel, subscribe. There is no need for you to watch this video. Get all the way to the end right here. And not subscribe. Like, help your girl out. I'm trying to get to my thousand subscribers, y'all. I'm trying to get this channel monetized so we can start getting these coins. Like, I've had this channel for what, about three years now. And it took one video to take off. And that's how I got up to 900 subscribers, which I don't even know where I'm at right now because I haven't been on YouTube. Um, but I'm trying to be consistent with everything now. I mean, I understand, you know, life happens, but hopefully I'm able to remain consistent throughout the rest of the year. But yeah, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend, and I will see you guys in the next video.